Research in the area. Is it a lively, progressive town or city or jurisdiction? Is it desirable? Are people willingly move into that area? Perhaps it's up, up and coming, perhaps it's already established. Uh, you've got great schools, there's opportunity for small to medium sized businesses that are consistently opening in that area. Look down the high street, are, are there a lot of closed stores or are people opening up on a regular basis? Is there a, a high demand for property in that area? Look at your competition. What is the average house price and, and price for an apartment in that area? Is it level, are prices increasing? Um, do you have to talk to people perhaps before you make a decision where to base yourself? Have a chat with a few of the local business owners, sit down in the calf, go, go, go to a restaurant or two, have a chat with business owners that are established or maybe just new into the area. Are they struggling? Are they being successful? Um, look at transport, transportation for both you and for people traveling to and from work. Are they good transport links within that area? Uh, have, again, have a look at the competition. Look, look at who the market leaders are. Compare fees. What, what, are, what are these agents charging? Is, is it a case of the lower fee gets the business? Or are there good agents in the area that win in high fees um, amongst the, the top end of the competition? So what's the advice I can give to you? You're looking to become an estate agent. Ask yourself, are you committed? Why, why are you going into property industry? Is this going to be a part-time role for you? Will it be full-time? How much time can you give this? Is it something perhaps you've thought about for a long time? Maybe somebody has recommended you, you'd be good at this. this. This would be a great opportunity for you. Have you got a friend that's already working in the property industry, works for an estate agent in a specific town? Um, and maybe there's, there's an opportunity within that office for, for somebody to come in on a trial basis, as, as a, a trainee. As far as the commitment levels, is this gonna be a part-time job for you? Are you gonna be doing this on a full-time basis? Once you commit to the client, you promise them you're gonna take responsibility to sell their property, to find the tenant for their property, you've gotta be on call. I'm not saying you can't have a bit of downtime in between, but you can't avoid phone calls, emails, you've gotta respond, responsiveness is very key here. You've got to turn up. A typical day for me as an estate agent would generally start the night before. Um, I've got my things to do list, I've got my plan, I've got my diary set up. Obviously there could be space in the diary, but generally I've got appointments in there for the following day. So I'll get up in the morning, I'm, I may have a, a bit of time. I generally like to read a chapter or two from, from a book that might be a sales orientated book from, from a, 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 a trainer or a motivator. I'll come into the office, we'll have a morning meeting amongst the whole team. It will go through the day ahead, the week ahead, results from the previous day, any offers that have got to be put forward to sellers. We'll decide who's dealing with that seller, whose client it is. Uh, we've got potential move-ins on properties. We may have an exchange of contracts due today. We've got to talk to solicitors to get that over the line. Um, I've got viewings in the diary. Occasionally, somebody may not come into the office. We've got to cover their appointments through the day. So we'll work out who's going to be doing what. Um, as far as valuation appointments, they're your key appointments through the day because it's potentially new business. So who's the best person to go around and value that property? Who knows the area the best? Would it, would it be myself? Would it be maybe one of, one of the guys? Um, we, I can't do everything, but at the same point, th there's gonna be a situation where you've got a potential client who is only available at seven or eight o'clock in the morning because they, they've gotta leave for the office at 8.30. Can, can we get around it? Absolutely we can. Is it gonna be a Sunday appointment, last minute? Somebody's gonna to wanna to step up. You've gotta be motivated. You wanna earn the money. You want the opportunity, take that opportunity and win the business. Um, I may have viewings later on in the afternoon. Uh, again, I may have a sit down with a client to present an offer. Um, we may have to chase an exchange of contracts. Got a solicitor that hasn't turned up for the last couple of weeks or a couple of days. And we've really gotta be forceful in getting that over the line. At the end of the day, we could have a completion. We're all going to be celebrating. The bell will ring. It's it's just every day is a different day being being in the world of an estate agent.